Do you worry about a trade war between China and the U.S.? And if yes, who would start it? Look, I think that the, the risk for U.S.-China trade confrontation is certainly very high this year. We're likely to see signals of when that might take place as early as this month, early this month, with the U.S. wrapping up the 301 investigation. We look at U.S.-China China trade confrontation as highly probable by Q2 this year. Okay, one, uh, you know, in your risk report, when you say that basically China likes a vacuum, what kind of vacuum are we talking about? Is it political or is it also economic? It's both. Uh, it's across the board, with the exception of a security vacuum, with the U.S. still remaining dominant there. But look, what you have is you have the strongest Chinese leader in decades, and he has amassed enough domestic political power to where he can now... Uh, turn his sights to shaping China's external environment and perhaps modifying the rules within. Uh, this comes at the time, of course, when the U.S. is turning away from what was a U.S.-led multilateral global order. So timing could not be better for Xi. So what does this mean in terms of markets and for business? It means that we're going to see in 2018 a much more influential and dominant China that's looking to shape the terms of trade and investment that will continue to shape infrastructure investment globally. Uh, but you also will begin to see perhaps global business norms begin to bend to yeah. new sets of rules and practices set forth by Beijing.